Maya was grumpy. Written and illustrated by Courtney Pippin Mather. Maya was grumpy. She didn't know why she was grumpy. She was just in a crispy, cranky, grumpy, grouchy mood. She didn't want to read or color or eat banana chips or wear her favorite shorts or go outside and play. The only thing Maya wanted to do was grouch around the house and share her bad mood. She grumped into Grandma's room and snarled at the cat. He just stretched and went back to sleep. She glumped into the living room and made faces at some birds. They just flew away. She clumped into the kitchen and grumbled at her brothers. They just glopped their food around. Finally, Maya thumped up behind Grandma and growled as loudly as she could. Feeling a bit grumpy today? Grandma asked. Maya just scowled. Well then, said Grandma, I guess that means no hunting for hippos after breakfast. I never hunt for hippos, Maya grouched. And no putting your head in a crocodile's mouth before lunch. That's just silly, Maya grumbled. Bathing baby elephants would probably be a bad idea today if you're grumpy, Grandma said. Maya rolled her eyes. Certainly no tickling tarantulas until they giggle, Grandma added. Maya shook her head. A tingle in her belly tickled all the way up to her mouth, but she squeezed her lips into a tight line. I did have plans to slide down the neck of a giraffe later, Grandma explained, but I guess we can reschedule. Maya felt a wiggle reach the corners of her frown. And definitely no swinging with monkeys today if you're grumpy. A bubbly giggle escaped through Maya's lips. Swinging with monkeys might be nice, she said. And she gave Grandma a big hug. Grandma packed a snack and fixed Maya's hair. Then they all went outside to find the hippos, crocodiles, elephants, tarantulas, giraffes, and monkeys. And Maya felt much better.